Atomic Brewery Redfern, we're a group of people inspired by, by really great beer and really great moments shared with friends. We feel that beer is not just about the liquid in your glass, but about the moments that it facilitates and it creates. We're also about exploring flavours in beer and, and being a little bit experimental, a little bit cheeky and flexing our creative muscles with the beers that we create. And ultimately, we want to create beers which create great moments for, for friends and family to enjoy. My name's Nicholas Ivey, I'm the head brewer here at the Atomic Brewery in Redfern. This project sits on the land of the Gadigal people of the Eora Nation, and we would like to pay respects to elders past, present and emerging. So Redfern is an inner city suburb of Sydney, just to the south. With the brief acknowledging that the suburb was kind of going through gentrification, we wanted to actually preserve some of the streetscape and the way that uh, the building looked. So. Uh, we wanted to approach it quite sensitively, uh, where we kept the exterior of the building basically raw and, and as it existed, except for the things that really needed upgrading, like the, the awning was, was almost falling down. And then internally with the building as well, uh, it's basically the design was defined by insertions within the existing space. So all of the existing walls are still that sort of raw brick. There's still spray paint from, from old building projects and, and the marks of demolition. So we wanted to be sensitive to the fact that things change, but also we wanted to acknowledge the past. We want people to feel uh, comfortable and welcome when they walk into our space. We also want them to feel open-minded. Uh, perhaps they've come in and, and they're not your traditional beer drinker or perhaps they hate beer. So we want them to, to feel open-minded and come in and maybe try something that they've never tried before and, and leave converted into a beer lover. And uh, we want them to feel like they can come and celebrate in our space, enjoy time with family, friends, and have great drinks and great food. So one of the big showpieces of, of, our, of our brewery is the bar top. It's pretty big and it's, and it's chunky and it's bright green. We wanted the bar to be a bit of a statement piece because everyone goes up to the bar, everyone puts their hands on the bar. So we want a really high quality material to be installed there. Uh, and it's also quite a unique color as well. And part of the reason why we chose that color is because that, that shade of green really reminds us of the color of hops, which is an ingredient that goes into beer that we're really passionate about. So that was kind of some a, a little bit of an insight into the decisions that we made around the bar. With the lighting that we installed, we've got uh, a building with a sawtooth roof, so there's some really high cavernous spaces. So with the lighting that we selected, we wanted to have lighting that dropped low and really highlighted focal points to kind of not make the space feel cavernous and empty. All the lighting that we chose as well was supposed to be soft and all of it's dimmable so that we could create mood at any time of day. We also chose some really select spotlights as well that highlight certain elements in the brewery and just create a little bit of drama around those spaces. I'm probably most proud of getting all of those tanks installed. They were a real challenge, especially because we had to install them once the bar had already been installed because of the coving that needed to happen on the, on the bar frame. So that was a real challenge. So I'm really, really proud to see them in that space and I hope I never ever have to take them out. And I'm also really proud of all of the people who contributed to this project because, you know, it's never just one person that does this. It was a huge team behind it. And I'm really proud of all those people who pulled together to, to build something which uh, is really special and hopefully enjoy for years to come. So what makes it unique? Well, well for one, I, I don't think I've ever seen a space like it. I don't think I've ever walked into a space which has got juxtaposition of the, the textured render with the industrial hardness of a brewery with the acknowledgement of the old existing building in a really raw form so I think the way that we've married all of those elements uh, is a really unique element of the build you know I think we've also really executed the, in, the, the combination of a brewery with a really comfortable hospitality space really well the, the brewery is a, a fantastic showpiece the, the beers taste great all of the seating's really really comfortable and we can get lots of people in here and and it really has a great vibe when the place is busy of an evening and great food's coming out of the kitchen and the woks are firing up and you can see the flames leaping up on the splashback. So 
I think it caters really, really well because it does everything that we kind of needed it to do from a functional perspective, but it's also really comfortable. So if you're actually coming in here to an enjoy an experience with us, you're gonna be comfortable and have a great time.